These are not your ordinary <laughs> pets. These dogs specially trained to work is the eyes of people who are visually impaired. And today they got to teach their new owners their new tricks. News 4's Greg Sergal has the story from Long Island. Murphy, left. Good boy. Angelina Acevedo and her new guide dog Murphy. Good boy are getting to know one another on the streets of Huntington this week. It's the start of a relationship that will change the life of this blind Harlem resident. I love the, the confidence and the amount of freedom I get from traveling with a guide dog. They're literally your eyes. Angelina's four-legged savior comes from a foundation that's been helping the visually challenged for 75 years. Take away our ability to move freely and safely. This is the world of the blind. This is an early promotional film for the Guide Dog Foundation of Smithtown. The nonprofit was first founded to help World War II veterans, but it's now matched 2,500 dogs with people in need all across the country. Where I live, there's like a lot of construction areas. The cane just wasn't doing what I needed to do. Brian Jacobowski of Pittsburgh put away that cane and is now on his second guide dog. The bond they share, he says, is very special. For us to trust them to get us to where we need to go, they have to be a lot smarter than us. Brian and his new dog, Rose, will be working together here on Long Island for two weeks before going home to Pittsburgh. The dogs really love what they do. Trainer Christina Mirabelli says each dog is bred by the foundation and raised by volunteers before being matched with a visually impaired person. Good girl. Yes. The foundation says the whole preparation process costs about $50,000 a dog, but the visually impaired pay nothing for the animals thanks to the generosity of corporate and individual donors. You learn a lot about yourself and more about partnership. My safety is in their paws. Greg Sergal, News 4 New York. Oh, wow, love it. That does it for us. News 4.